to the broadcast booth. Here's Dan Schulman and Pat Tabler. And the lineup card exchange just happened. This is just moments ago. That's Guillermo Martinez, the hitting coach for the Blue Jays, who rarely, as far as I am aware, Tabby, brings out the lineup card. He shakes Doug Eddings' hand. Eddings is at third today. He had the plate last night. And the strike zone, as everybody who watched the game knows, just was all over the place. And somebody, although that wasn't Eddings, I think that was the first base, first base of Lance yeah. Barrett who made the signal. And then Guillermo Martinez gets into it with Eddings. And unless that whole thing was fun in games, and we don't think it was, Guillermo Martinez is gone. He's sticking out for a sticking up rather for his hitters because of the strike zone last night. Um, and you can find it online if you're one to follow the umpire sites on Twitter. You can find it. And what it looked like online is what it looked like to the eye test last night as well. Pre-game plate meeting ejections aren't too common, but as Dan Schulman said, you have a coach that rarely goes to that meeting, which suggests Martinez was there for the express, explicit, and only purpose of getting tossed arguing Eddings calls from the night before. The manager ultimately dictates or at least is responsible for sending a coach to the pre-game plate meeting, so this could be a way for a general to get their point across while sacrificing a mere lieutenant. An interesting wrinkle is the ejecting umpire today, Lance Barrett, also injected Montoyo on May 11th, May 10th in New York. So this is technically the same crew, although Eddings wasn't on it at the time. On May 10th, Eddings was busy ejecting Luis Torrens 3,000 miles away that night and Alfonso Marquez was chiefing in New York instead. As for the actual numbers from last night's game with Eddings behind the plate, here they are. They look like they look. The skew favors the team that is not Toronto. And as for the ejection, yes, arguing a prior game's calls is ejectable, and quite frankly, everyone knows that. Even the person who was ejected, they went out with the goal of getting ejected. This is a good pitcher, but a guy who's been struggling lately. He has really struggled over his last four starts. He came into that start against the Blue Jays on May the 31st with an ERA of 263. Look where it is today 